Hi class, I know you're busy re uh, revising, so um, this short video is just to clarify and answer some of your questions. So the first thing that I like to go over to is it's a very tiny but important uh, aspect in the calculation, uh, particularly on using the uh, C log B uh, to calculate the um, and to predict the solubility of compounds using the uh, pi values. Yeah. I've shown you in my lecture about this, um, how you can calculate log p or c log p uh, using the pi values. Um, and in this case, the aliphatic c is, uh, I believe, causing a few confusions um, with you uh, when we actually use the aliphatic c when we actually count aliphatic C as, as bonds. So, um, thanks to one of you who came to clarify your thoughts about this. So, instead of counting um, aliphatic C as bonds, you could count the number of carbon atoms in your compound. You see, in this case, if I just zoom down to the molecule, if you take the uh, carbon for the aliphatic, com uh, aliphatic chain, yeah? so there should be 12 there. You can try to count on your own. Yeah? And the carbon on here, the one in purple, um, not counted as um, aliphatic because they are connected to the aromatic ring. 